How's it going, guys? It's Poetry Sin, and welcome back to the episode of the Europa Universalis 4 Emperor Expansion Burgundian Campaign. We're playing as Burg Burgundy trying to form Lotharingia. How far are we from that again? I don't actually remember. I believe we just need to... We have to own Aachen and Lorraine. We also have to own more of the Rhineland. Uh, Holland, Frisia. So we have those. I also it shows us, right? Basically just all the stuff up in here, which is, is unfortunate. It's difficult. And we have a lot of aggressive expansion, unfortunately, but not much choice. I mean, if we want to form Lotharingia, that's what we got to do. That's what we got to do. Uh, and it's, you know, it's not like it's, a, it's supposed to be an easy thing. Free stability is huge. It's huge. Um, do, you, do you know anyone who says, you know, huge, like huge? My dad actually says like that sometimes, and we tease him about it, but, you yeah. Um... But yeah, so I'm pretty sure we're going to lose this war. I think it's just a matter of time. I think it's possible that maybe Ottomans will peace out separately. But no, that doesn't make sense because they don't have anything they really want. And they're not occupying anything, so I'm not sure what they would take. Are they rivaled to me, though? That, may, that would make me worried. They are. Hmm, because like, maybe they'll make me release stuff. And that would be unfortunate. But, I mean, that's the thing, though. It's Brigens is the one who is the war leader, so it's, it's going to be up to them. Hmm, it's fine. I'll handle that later. Yeah, now the Ottomans... Uh, so they're basically have been... It's The war has basically been pushed slowly and surely west. Further, further west. And further south. Um, and that sucks. <laughs> they're slowly getting closer. Um, but... I... I don't know, man. I, I think it's okay. I think we're doing okay. As long as we're not getting sieged down a lot, oh, which is maybe going to start changing soon. That's the problem, is it's going to start changing. And freeze. I can't do this right now. Not right now, maybe later, but I can't deal with these rebels right now. These rabble rousers. Um, yeah, let's do Deplor Rapture, why not? I don't care about the train loads right now, we got bigger fish to fry. Boomer casualties. Okay, that was an enemy. Should be able to win this, right? We have a, a woods bone. Yeah, they're not even in it. In a reinforce. We do have a lot of like good woods forts and hills forts on our border with the empire. Luckily, so even though France is pretty like. Uh, like, it's fertile, but as a result, it's also not very defensible, right? And because of that, it is, uh, uh, it's, it's a tough, tough, uh, job to defend it. Um, but at the same time, we have, our border area is, is fairly easily defended, and that's more important, if anything, right? So, take the good with the bad. Rebels are actually fine there. Low enthusiasm on both sides. Come on, my dudes. Hmm. Alright, let's go try to get Switzerland out, maybe? No, I'll try to get these guys killed first. Hmm. Definitely gonna need to recover a little while for, uh, after this. Oh, fudge. They and we're still gonna win. We outnumber them with three to one, but that sucks that they got that siege. That's fine. So here, just just come up here. Ah, uh, lordy. Um. Hmm. Yeah. No. I, I don't. There's no way we win this, but. It is possible we get a piece of Westphalia because of the fact that they're so low. In fact, if we can do a, a, a uh, concerted push towards Bregenz and get their capital, it's possible we can make something happen, you know? Who are our vassals? We have Munster and an Armagnac and Berg. I do think we should 
I think we should uh, integrate Berg soon. Yeah, they're not really as useful anymore. And Munster has cores here, so that's what we're going to be. Wait on. Yep, it happened. What happened? Defeat. Shameful defeat, it says right there. Are you kidding me? They did make me release something. Wow. You have all those people in that war, and yet you make me release something. It's one province, right? We're absolutely fine. But, but that sucks. Wow. Um... Oh, gosh darn it. So Protestantism is the dominant faith. One thing I'm not clear about, I've never been clear about, is so only Protestant rulers are eligible to become emperors. So I was kind of thinking early about going reformed, but like that's not gonna that's not gonna help us. We need to go Protestant if we want to have a chance. Um I kind of feel like maybe that's what we do. If we become Protestant It'll help so much with, with conquering everything. We'll be in the running for the Emperor. In fact, Austria, well, Austria will probably uh, flip, too. Yeah, I think we flip. I think we flip. Uh, I think that's the way to go. Even though I'd love to stay Catholic. I've been doing that in my other game, and so I, I don't think we've missed out. We, in fact, we actually already got to do a Golden Bull. So, here's what we do. We wait till we can get um, 105 stability. Or 105, so we can get our stability for free. And then we hop out of this war, or this uh, religion. Yeah. All right. We really, again really see Strauss, Strasbourg is not a huge deal. Whatever. Hmm. Or if we doing something like this actually will earn us people influence. And no, 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 don't do that, don't do that. But uh, we could do, well, no, that's going to give us religious zeal. All right, well, since we know we're going to want to do that, let's not do that then. Um, Armagnac, I can afford that. We should start annexing either Berg or, um, yeah, like we're, we're ahead on Diplo, don't get me wrong. We have enough to do this. We do have the policy, correct? Yeah, we have that. So it's pretty cheap. It's it's not actually that bad to, to annex them. Yeah, it's time to, to start annexing them. It won't be that long, and it's a good bit of land. It'll be it'll be fine. And obviously, long term, we, we want to conquer. We want to conquer all of Germany, right? We want to re reform the Frankish Empire, basically, right? So um, we did lose the Curia to Austria, so that makes me feel less bad about ditching on them in a minute here. And again, I think this is a strong reformation. Like, look at the reformation. A reformed is actually more strong than any, anything else, or or is more surprising at least. Um, the Protestant Reformation is still pretty good, but still doing pretty well. But yeah, um, I think we we flip. I mean, we flip um, here, but we'll go on speed five actually because I think we're not going to do. I mean, we're we're recovering. We're in a recovery state now. We're not going to be doing anything. Um, one of the following must be true. I was like, what do you mean Netherlands declares independence? No, they haven't. Are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, that's annoying. Well, it gets rid of the... <laughs> it gets... It gets rid of the, uh... Of the, the, the disaster, at least. Uh, that's something to look forward to. <laughs> Oh, lordy. Okay, so the Netherlands has declared independence. That really sucks. Dutch War for Independence. I think this is like a special CB, because um, it's independence, but they're not a vassal of mine. I don't remember how it works. So that's okay. Well then, this is certainly even a little, this is a little more interesting than I thought, huh? Mm, okay. Luckily, it's only them in the Commonwealth. Well, and you know, I mean, obviously, Obviously, the Commonwealth is nothing to... Uh, the Papal States left of the Empire. Cool. Um, Commonwealth is nothing to sneeze about, but... We do have... Oh, we have Sweden on our side. We have... Oh, oh lovely. Austria. They're going to be so super helpful. Yeah. Uh, okay. Not sure why that changed that way it just did but you know i'm okay with that okay i know we have a military idea group but i, I really want to get through the siege so we can secure the rest 
Alright, um... Yeah, no, I mean, this is... This sucks, but... Hmm... Lose a little prestige, that's fine. Oh, lord. So I don't know what causes this event that we just had happen here, but, uh... But, uh, you know, I suppose... It's whatever. <laughs> it's already happened now. Let's just deal with it as best we can. I think we're strong enough to deal with it. Commonwealth wasn't in that war, though, which is unfortunate. It means that they're gonna basically be, uh... They're at full strength right now. Although they are fighting another, another war, it looks like? Uh, yeah, a few miners, but still, better than nothing. Uh, hold on. We can use that right now. Thank you. Alright. Uh, they're basically full siege. That's good. So I'm pretty sure in the peace deal, can, can we take everything back? Or are they going to exist? There's no way to, like... Oh, gosh, are you kidding me? There's no way to, like, enforce peace and just take everything? That's that's really actually very annoying. Wow. No, that can't be right. Is it is it really right? That's so annoying. You know what we could do? We could vassalize them. I don't believe that gets rid of our cores, and if it does, I'll just alt F4 and, and reset. Uh, if we get rid of all of our cores, we can just annex them after 10 years. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Could, wait, can we do that, though? <laughs> yeah, no. I, that's kind of lame, though. Like, you should be able to de defeat them in one war. I get it, right? Like, the... Yeah, Netherlands strong. Haha. -ha. Um, but... That's kind of annoying. It's kind of annoying. It's very annoying. Like, if they're breaking... <clears throat> breaking free, we should at least be able to reinforce the our rule. Like, we should be able to say, no, you're not, and crush them down quick enough. Apparently not. Apparently, we have to let them go for a while. Again, it's not a huge deal. So, whatever. Um, ah, lovely. Fighting other people's rebels. That's what I'd love to do. Alright, that's very annoying. We already have the worst workhouse versus other religions, so it's not going to help right now. I'm a little worried that they're going to come here and try to smash up these armies, so let's do this. And you know what the worst part is? Everyone in, in, is in a coalition around us, so they're not going to... Uh, they're not really going to let me just sit here and do this. Oh my god, fuck off. Mm -hmm. It's one bad thing after another. Lovely, look at that. Thanks, game. Lovely. I love you, game. Yay. You're such a fair and benevolent game. I love you, game. And... This game is pissing me off right now. Ugh. I wish the Netherlands thing was like a special CD because I'm... Is there a decision maybe I'm missing? No, not that I can see, so that sucks. Um... Man. Hmm. Could I, like, give the Commonwealth something? What would they want? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. All right. Hmm. France is no longer great power. Who is surprised by that? Alright, well, it does suck that um, we have to fight the Commonwealth, but at least other people didn't join, because it, it, it's pretty much, I think, like an open invitation for any, I don't know how it determines it, is it like any great power, maybe it gives it to any great power that wants uh, to join, gives them a chance, I don't know. Hmm. Our states are pretty loyal, at the very least. Let's keep going. 
Alright, um... Let's just, you know, let's just chill. We're, we're fine. We're still fine. This coalition is not going to fire, almost certainly. Um, we'll, we'll just conquer France a little bit at a time. Let's focus on the easier, you know, path of least resistance, right? Path of least resistance. What happened? You bastards, Austria. I hate you, Austria. I'm not gonna ally you after this, just so you know, Austria. And especially now that you're not the Emperor. Yeah, screw you. Screw you, my dude. At least the Imperial Authority is so low that I don't think we're ever gonna see a unified empire here. What was that? Did you see that lighting glitch? That was weird. You normally don't have that many glitches like that in this game. Hmm, fine. Okay, to plonk we go. P lock. Uh, okay, that's fine. If we can get a couple sieges here, they don't have any sieges on us, should be fine. To P lock, boys! Alright. Sweden is gonna help. Yeah, we kind of need like a reset. Not a reset in the terms of the campaign, but like. Just no wars for a little bit, no rebels for a little bit, just a little bit of peace, please. Oh, that's good. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. All right. Let's get their capital and then get the heck out of this war, this cursed war. I might just assault it, honestly. No, 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 don't think like that. Let's, let's be, let's be reasonable here. Reasonable. All right, Berg is now integrated. Oh, you know what? Did that put us over? Oh, no. You know what? <laughs> we gained some, but also we're still a lot lower anyways, because the Netherlands is little bastards. Uh, yeah, I'm going to do that. Yeah, this sucks, so. Um, I'm on the wrong side of history, apparently. Are you kidding me? They're still that enthusiastic about this war? Alright, well, you know what? I'm just gonna have some mercy on you? No, I'm just gonna crush your army now. Hopefully. A little closer than I would like, huh? I have your capital, my dude! Carpet siege him. Hmm, hit them where it hurts. They're pocketbooks. Um. That might actually be a loss. It's definitely gonna be a loss. Wow. You guys are very annoying, you know that? You know that, Commonwealth? You're very annoying. I actually hate you, Commonwealth. I actually hate you with a burning passion. <clears throat> Gosh darn it. And now it's all gonna fall apart. Oh, I mean, This war, not the whole thing, hopefully. But, but look at those troops, though. They have so many troops. Are you kidding me? Come on, seriously? You bastards. Pfft, yeah, right. <laughs> Think I'm gonna give up all that? You're crazy. Here. Let's come hang out down here for a bit. How about that? Sweden is uh, still at high enthusiasm, so we should be okay. I'm just a little worried that other people are gonna start joining our coalition if we don't get out of this quick. Hmm, break our alliance with uh, Austria, maybe? I was like, where's Austria? Uh... Yeah, I'm not doing that. <sighs> you know what? I think we need to hire rebels here. Or, er, rebels, yeah, let's hire rebels. That makes sense. Tire mercs here. 
I actually think we should consolidate all of our types. Um, and then hire a stack of mercs. Take on a bit of debt, but hire some mercs. Now, let's do it. I was gonna say, like, why can't I get there? It's weirdness from the whole merc thing. Hmm. You are such bastards, Commonwealth, you know that? Man, I'm so pissed right now. This game just wants to watch me suffer, you know? Sometimes it's like that, though. Let's bum rush them. Hold on, hold on. I know I'm a little hesitant. Fuck. I don't care right now, I got bigger fish to fry. Ay, ay, ay. Commonwealth, just get out of this war, dude. Why do you care about the about the Netherlands anyways? You shouldn't care about them. Oh fuck. East Frisia has joined the Republic. You bastards. You wankers, that's fine. This is bad. Cause this is a woods fort. Guess who's gonna lose another battle? This is awful. This is a train wreck. I hate it. I just want, like, ugh, why is the Commonwealth in this war? Like, well, I get it. They, like, they're, they're supposed to, like, you know, great powers can intervene. Why can't I eat all of the land back in one war? If it, like, it's, it's a special situation. Why is it that, why, why can't there be, like, a decision or something? Like, if you manage to completely destroy them, no, you just have to suffer through it. Uh, just because the game wants to screw with you. So there. I don't think it's very... I don't know. I feel like there should be a way to rein them in, kind of. Like, you know. Um, and, yeah, but... Mm, I don't know. They're still at war with the planet, too. It's just that they... The, the AI has a hatred for players, so they um, just focus on the players only. Of course, because of course they do. Um, I don't care about Castile. This might not be a good battle. Actually, it's definitely not a good battle. Probably should not have done this, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Man, screw you, Commonwealth. <coughs> Sorry. Yeah, but the problem is I can't, like, feed them anything from Sweden because they don't want anything from Sweden, surprisingly. I'm surprised they don't want stuff up, he stuff up here in Livonia because I normally love that stuff. Uh, I lo like, love taking that land, you know? All right, well, so I think our, our best bet is going to be just, uh, lovely. Oh, they inherited Brandenburg, finally. That's right, I forgot about that. Oh, Monka S. <laughs> Alright, uh... 
Fuck you. Fuck you, Commonwealth. I hate you. I actually hate you, Commonwealth. I'm actually gonna remember this and burn your entire country to the ground later. I will destroy a whole generation of your men in return for this. I will remember this. You bastards. Not very annoying. Mm-hmm. Uh, unfortunately, we might get declared on by other people because we're very weak right now. Fuck off. Oh my god. Are you shitting me? Hold on. And now we're locked. Gosh darn, I should be going on a slower speed. But also, fuck this game right now. Yeah, that war really... I really should not have joined the League War, apparently, because it is absolutely destroying my country. Oh my god, that's a big ol' army. Uh-oh, this could be really bad. I don't even- I can't even white piece now. I just realized this is- this is actually awful. Holy shit. Um... How many days do we have? Not that long. Do we have enough to win by this? We're not gonna win in time. This is fucked, dude. This is fucked. This is fucking awful. I hate this. Just let me peace out, please. Oh my god. Fuck you, Netherlands. Fuck you. Oh my god. I. Right. This is... Oh, this is very annoying. I actually hate this. Why the heck... Why in the heck can I not... So, so why is it an independence war? A special independence war, CV. Yeah, no, fuck you, Papal State. Oh my god. Uh, Protestant, thank you. Goodbye, Catholics. Fuck you, Papal State. Alright. Uh, I think it's actually bad design, like the fact that the Netherlands can break free with a special CB, and yet you can't, and yet you can't, like, eat them back in a special way if you manage to beat them. Obviously, I didn't beat them as a fucking commonwealth, but, like, like I was full occupying them for, like, five years there or something silly like that. So, where's the, you know, where's the logic in that? I don't really see it. I don't really like it. Um, I, I kind of think it's lame. I think, I think that we should be able to, it, like, the CB should have it built in. It should be a special CB or something, because it should have the CB built in so that reconquest, which is literally what we're doing, and it's not even, like, a, a long reconquest after a long time. It's, like, fresh. It's, they literally just broke free. It should be, um, it should be like a a uh, reconquest that is like a ridiculous amount cheaper, or, or or just reconquest at all, because I'm pretty sure it was full cost for each province. If it was cheaper, then I could have done it. I don't know. I just think that's that was stupid. I think that was very very stupid. Um, did not appreciate that. All right, let's go deal with these separatists and stuff. We we have problems to deal with, obviously. But tell you what, I'm going to wrap up this episode. I don't know. Tell me your thoughts. Am I overreacting or was that kind of lame? <laughs> uh, I think we're still fine. Like, we're still strong. We're, we just got to have to kind of, we're going to have to bounce back from this. So thank you guys for watching. Please go ahead and uh, leave a like and subscribe for more if you enjoyed. Sorry for all the cursing, but obviously I get a little salty. Um, but, you know, it's fine. I still love this game. It just is has some bullshit moments. <laughs> uh, yeah, thanks for hanging out, guys. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.